Hello there beautiful people. I hope you are having a creative day. In this quick Wix Studio tutorial, I'm going to show you how to swap cells in Wix Studio. So it's going to be a very quick tutorial. Um, so without further delay, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is create cells. So I'm going to just go here in this section and add a cell to the right side. And I'm going to give it a different color. Something like this. And now let's say you want to swap these cells. You want to uh, get this cell on the left side and this one on the right side. Okay, so how do we do that? Well, um, it's very easy actually. All you have to do is hold shift and select both these cells together. Right, so just hold shift and uh, select these two. And then you will have the option to swap them. So you can just click on it and now you have the position of the cell inverse. Okay, you can do this again. And this also works when you have multiple cells. So if I, uh, let's say, further divide this cell into two more, and let's add a different colors, like this. And if you wanna swap the cells, you can also do this vertically. So you can select them like this and click on swap. And now you have different position, the inverted position of these two cells, all right? And you can do the same, by the way, on the tablet and mobile as well. Uh, one thing you should understand though is that when you uh, change the position of the cells on a larger breakpoint, in this case the desktop, it will automatically invert in the uh, smaller breakpoint as well. However, if you uh, change the cell position in a smaller breakpoint, it will uh, change the position on much smaller, for example, the mobile here, but it will not affect the larger breakpoints like the desktop. So if I change the cell position, for example, in the tablet, like this, if you go to the mobile, you will see the change, but if you go to the desktop, you won't see the uh, inversion of the cell position. Okay, so if you want to make the change on all the breakpoints, um, swap the position on the largest breakpoint. However, if you want to exclude a certain breakpoint, then go to the smaller breakpoint and change it there. Now, if you uh, go to the mobile, for example, and you wanna swap the white and this uh, cell right here, you can do that as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and select these two and click on swap. Okay, so the white um, cell is now here, but if you go to the larger breakpoints, you won't see any change here, all right? So this is how you can change the cell position. This is how you swap the cells in Wix Studio. I hope you learned something. Thanks for watching.